Rising higher than 14,000 feet, the mountain is surrounded by glaciers, emerald forests, and crystalline streams. Waterfalls cascade gracefully down as the blossoms of springtime parade up the vertical landscape. This is a natural place. This is Mount Rainier. Mount Rainier National Park is located in the northwestern United States of America in southwestern Washington. On a clear day in the Pacific Northwest, the sky is dominated by snow-capped mountains. But one single mountain stands out, like a giant snow cone floating in the sky. This is the Grand Mount Rainier. Looking at Rainier, a pastoral setting complements this tremendous mountain. Mount Rainier is just over 14,400 feet tall. Mount Rainier, like many of the mountains in the Pacific Northwest, is a dormant volcano. These mountains are a part of the Ring of Fire, which is a volcanic ring nearly encircling the Pacific Ocean. About three-fourths of the active volcanoes in the world are found within this ring. This grand mountain rose up as a result of the theory of plate tectonics the theory which holds that the Earth's surface is made up of several huge plates that collide with each other, causing friction deep below the surface of the Earth and melting rock into what will become lava. Molten rock found its way to the surface through fissures, and so the building of this grand mountain began. Lava flowed building on the newly shaped cone. About a million years ago, this tremendous mountain was in its infancy, erupting and growing. About 75,000 years ago, it reached its greatest height, nearly 16,000 feet tall. Today, Mount Rainier is the highest peak in the Pacific Northwest. But Rainier is no ordinary mountain. It is a composite volcano, the most explosive type in the world. Although it is dormant for now, Rainier erupted in ancient times, much like nearby Mount St. Helens recently showed the world. On May 18, 1980, Mount St. Helens blew with a massive eruption, blasting its north side, sending ash and mud and devastating more than 150 square miles.